Hi, if you are new here, I'm Kanitsi, and if you're already watching this channel, welcome back. Today we are watching 20th episode of Anime to Your Eternity, and this is the last episode of the season. So we are finishing the season, yay, I'm very excited, because as I said in the previous, my reaction that it's probably going to be some kind of transitional episode, be more quiet, less drama, we're just setting on to a new journey, so let's see what this episode actually has, let's go. All right. Yeah, I'm not without some casualties. Yeah. Okay, that was that was a pretty short recap of the previous episode. Let's see. Probably there are not going to be any changes to the opening yet. Probably just in the next season we are going to get a new one with new characters. And I feel like, yeah, maybe you could say there are some spoilers, to be honest. In the opening there were a lot of hints to like what is going to happen, who are we going to meet and even like seeing some of the kids as zombies it was pretty obvious that something is gonna happen to them and then uh, it did, it was actually like a scene from the anime itself. Uh, so I'm not sure like do it. Do I even want to? Because with Georgia I remember I skipped the openings for as long as they had spoilers in them and kind of watched them in the end. It's less convenient, obviously, you have to kind of scroll through it and then while editing you need a different time. We didn't meet this person yet. At the same time, it's kind of fun finding some kind of hints in the opening, so probably I'll still watch it for the next season as well. Um, but yeah, yeah, I think it is kind of spoiler, but that's all often the case, I think, with anime and spoilery openings. Okay, this, <laughs> this whole opening ended up me talking about, okay, well, in any case, let's watch the episode. Um, thanks, seems like a nice meal, very... Oh, Pyaran waiting for him, in a restaurant. <laughs> Eating nothing, <laughs> probably everything she just had money for, <laughs> I'd say. I don't think she's like on a diet or something. I think she didn't have money for anything else. <laughs> mm. Does he want to abandon her as well so she will be safer? Yeah, he has this thoughts all the time. The sound of his pose is so cute. Echoes. But then she'll have to wait forever. At least come say hi, say that you're okay. Dude. That is sad. And in any case, if Pyaran is a, still a wanted criminal, she's still kind of in danger by herself as well, you know? <laughs> oh, also, he can probably replicate money as well. It's a bit of a swindling, how to say it, but... <laughs> oh, that's kind. Oh, she's like such a sweet granny, look at her. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, but maybe she's worried about you. Maybe at least say hi. Dude. And then leave. Oh, okay. She might recognize the fruits, though. That's kind of a way of doing it as well. He left a gift. So she sees it and thinks, oh, Emma left it for me. That, that's not a bad... Okay. <laughs> oh, you got it now. Okay. <laughs> oh, interesting. I... I thought the fruits actually was the idea of telling her that kind of I've been here. <laughs> Kid is like, what the heck was that? <laughs> wow, that's a big piece of paper. Well, you're doing well in any case. Everything looks so tidy. <laughs> She's still asleep. God, he's fast. <laughs> Wait, where are the fruits, though? The fruits have disappeared. It probably was just a mistake. I think they were there as well. <laughs> Looks like it's a funny kind of episode. <laughs> he's just running around... In, in in the end, maybe he decides, okay, I'll, I'll just stay with her. <laughs> Disappeared. How do they know, though? <laughs> yeah, she, she is kind of... Obviously, yeah, she can make it by herself. She has been making it for so many years. But... Yeah, I, <laughs> I don't think so. I think he's kind of neutral. Is that pure? <laughs> Way to word it. Yeah, thanks for making it better, man. Th that is true, you know, anything can happen, you know, in this world. Yeah. Like... A brick can fall on her head and, you know, anything can happen. Or she, yeah, she can die like a more natural death, right? Yeah, just go back to her. <laughs> I think he also kind of feels lonely. He wants to go with her, actually. Mm -hmm. He is. He does feel lonely. So he, he's getting all these human feelings, right? Feeling of loneliness. Oh, he got all the... F oh, he got all the forms. Well, 
no, that's not quite what happened. He was like, I'm out of here. Let him have his nervous breakdown. Uh, something warm for her. So after all, he decided to leave. She is fast! Holy shit! And she recognized him right away! Oh, that's kind of cute! Oh gosh! I think his friendship with Pirata is adorable. <laughs> and she's kind of lovable, right? I mean... <laughs> really? Everywhere? So, are they living here now, or there's some... Or are we meeting new characters? Oh, and they have been added as well, this free. Hmm. Yeah, that was something maybe for the next uh, season. Ninety. She's doing great. I want to be as healthy and agile at ninety. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. He gets more like feelings and understanding of his feelings. Interesting. I don't think you can really correlate it to human years. Oh, this is Piafka. I don't remember how it's in English. Oof. Leech, thank you. He can control when he wakes up? How? That's useful! <laughs> yeah, that would be nice. <laughs> She's funny. Yeah, unfortunately. Wouldn't it be nice to always stay young, right? <laughs> is like she's saying that Emma is her grandchild or so yeah she's like a we had a mom a friend uh, I mean a brother friends and the grandma so 
so they were living calmly and chillfully but even like without the danger of knockers she's just dying from old age uh, like her body is starting to fail and her memory is starting to fail she's getting more temper tantrums <laughs> yeah the, the memory is also one of the scariest ones right and then they don't even recognize you Oh, no, this is going to be a sad episode as well. What the fuck? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, unfortunately, her, her mind is also starting to fail. That is sweet. Is that what people usually say before they die in the anime? <laughs> she has such a nice place to sleep here. It looks so cute. So cozy. Old people can also wander off. Like she can just... Well, he can find her, I guess. Um, in that case, maybe she's just going to fall asleep and not wake up, unfortunately. But yeah, that is. And she lived a long. Oh, that might have been a symbol. See, the smoke stopped. Uh, she still lived a long life. That's what. I... Is he going to get her form as well? I wonder. Wait. Is this possible? That's interesting. And this is so, so cute of her to be useful. She is actually pretty kind. Uh, and he is listening. He's like, hmm. Mm hmm. That's fair. Like, it won't be you anymore. Oh, poor girl. She looks so tired from this life. A beautiful woman. <laughs> that is interesting. He is very powerful. Well, as I said, he seems to be like a creator. But he said he she was going to paradise. That's pretty cool. <gasps> That's the girl from the opening. Wait, is that like young Pierrand? Did she become like herself again? Just young? Like, did she look like that when she, she was younger? Or uh, is this just like a completely new form? Interesting.
Or is this like her soul? Another orb? Oh yeah, her purple eyes are so cute! That is so unexpected to be honest, that's a... Yeah, that is her. But what about like, her, okay, her old body is still here, but he took her spirit and put it in the orb. Is, does this create another orb or is she being reborn as someone? Yeah, she's smiling. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Poor Emma. Shit. Now he is all alone. You know, also, like, he, he had someone, right? Um, and it felt nice, you know, but now he will feel lonely again without his guide anymore. Well, I said before that she has kind of the role of the guide, you know. But she also had, like, a role of the grandmother the, or the old parent, you know, this kind of thing. He got to know this side of life as well. And we still have the donkey. <sighs> Oh, that's very, very pretty. It's like a s ceremonial fire. <laughs> I feel like cremation is nicer than... What's it called? Oh, his nose is all red from crying. What? She wrote something on the other side. A secret message. Always nice to receive. That was beautiful. I mean, she was such a cool character and it looks like we are kinda gonna meet her again. It won't be really her, but her reborn, so... Yeah, but yeah, as creator said, like it, it won't be really her spirit anymore because it was tied to the body. It will be something new, but so the PRN that we knew, she, she is dead. And yeah, she was so fun and like... <laughs> For a while after, okay. Several decades? Wait, are you serious? Such a time skip? Huh? What about Piran Rebirth? Several decades. D did she re reborn as a baby and we're gonna meet her as 20 year old someone? <laughs> oh, this is a knocker's heart. He was fighting knockers again? He grew up again. He stayed in his like f same form again for a long time. But yeah, it is a cool reveal. He looks really hot. <laughs> but <laughs> um, <laughs> what was I going to say? But we saw him grow up already before. And when he changed his forms again, he became small again. So I'm not sure. Is he really gonna stay in his grown up? Um, I'm sorry. <laughs> A pretty guy form or is he gonna go back to that young boy option again once he transforms here and there um, but uh, that was pretty interesting I liked I liked this episode a lot I was wondering like what is going to happen the last episode of the season where we kind of finished that arc but that was beautiful and I think that was such a great final chapter for his relationship with Pioran, his, like, not, not in romantic sense, but, like, relationship, you know, in general sense. And 
I think that that was like a great episode. I loved it a lot. And yes, yeah, I said it um, was it like a closing chapter for this season as well. Since we spent so much of the season also like with Pioran, and now I think in about like the ages as well because the first one we met was March and she was a kid and then we met Gugu he was also kind of a kid but he, we saw him grow up and then we um, okay we didn't actually meet someone who was well Gugu still he was close to like a teenager how old he was so mostly we were meeting kids I was thinking okay maybe there was something like growing up we meet like a very small kid then an older kid and and then a grandma is the last one to kind of die and to end our journey I thought okay we are missing a bit of like chunk here to make this point that we are going from like the childhood uh, to the very much like adulthood and uh, how do you call the this I don't know, grandmotherhood? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah, but I think uh, I, f I don't know what to say. She was a very interesting character with some good traits, maybe some bad traits, uh, with uh, very fiery personality. And I thought she was really fun. I thought she was really likable. And then. Uh, Imma also got attached to her and she was pretty sweet to him to be honest uh, so they kind of formed this bond uh, but now she's unfortunately deceased but uh, the question is he kind of he it seems he didn't get her form and I guess you could also say oh but her form wouldn't even be that useful uh, because uh, yeah she was pretty agile and strong for an old person but by the time she died she was already uh, like barely moving it seems right Imma had to carry her a lot and uh, but his forms are not only for use in battle it's also for remembering so he might still has uh, has the ability to re replicate her to remember her right and at the same time, there was also this interesting point of her vision to be reborn as someone useful to I for Imma. Um, I'm assuming that it's going to be a human. So maybe we are going now that several decades passed. I have okay, a few decades, let's say 20 years, right? Um, we maybe 30, t t let's say 20 for example we could meet this beautiful woman who is 20 years old and it would be like Pioran reborn maybe for us for viewers she would even look like a young Pioran but as uh, the creator said it's not going to be you she isn't going to remember her life as Pioran she's gonna be like a completely new person even if that is like her spirit moving on it wouldn't be the same that's how I understood it but in any case I think that was a great final episode that was very sweet and I enjoyed it a lot it was beautiful and uh, I think now uh, we are just uh, that was a strange moment maybe that I misunderstood there where a man came to some kind of buildings asking like are your wounds healed and then he got dragged in by someone it's like wait what what that was a strange moment maybe i misunderstood something i thought okay maybe it's something for the next season but now like few decades have passed so probably not it was it like pure run dragging him in for i don't know what happened there to be honest i was confused um but overall yes um i feel like um, yeah, my thoughts are all over the place right now. Um, I'm not sure what else I can add. So I'll probably just finish it right here. And we'll see what the next season brings overall. I guess my general thoughts on the season overall. I enjoyed it a lot. I thought it was really emotional. Unfortunately, very sad. But I think it's a beautiful story. It's really interesting to follow. Uh, the characters are pretty cool. I really like that they are very multifaceted. It's not like oh, a super good character, a super bad character. Uh, they all have their second like, strengths and their weaknesses and kind of 
bad uh, traits, worse traits. I guess the most angelic character was Gugu, uh, but in general, they are very interesting and deep characters that you kind of enjoy getting to know. Maybe you annoyed by someone, maybe you kind of hate someone, maybe you like someone, uh, but uh, yeah, they are actually they actually feel like personalities like uh, real beings you know not uh, uh, flat in their personality and um very diverse and interesting to follow and i'm excited to see what happens in the next season but yeah i think that will be it for today uh, if you have any thoughts please share them in the comments down below and maybe i'll, I'll have something new to add if there is some form of discussion and if you watched my reactions to to your eternity season one i hope you enjoyed them yeah as i said that would be it for today so thank you for watching and see ya mm -hmm.